Hello and welcome for a brief study on cantharides. Cantharides uh, is a is a subtopic which falls under animal poisons. So we have studied snake poisons. We have studied uh, scorpion poisons. Now we will study cantharides. And cantharides uh, is an insect. And I am trying to show you one insect here itself. You can see that insect. And uh, this is poisonous. Okay. Uh, it is commonly called as Spanish fly uh, and also commonly it is called as cantharis and cantharis is a uh, is one remedy in homeopathy which is usually used for urinary tract infections which is made or prepared from this insect so i in the beginning i had told you that the poisons are also medicine and poisons if they are having lethal dose it can take your life so we'll study cantharis, cantharis, or you know cantharides or Spanish fly in a brief uh, manner. Uh, you can see this word cantharidin. So cantharidin uh, is produced by this cantharide or Spanish fly insect. Okay, a defensive chemical produced by uh, the beetles to ward off predator attacks. So it want to prevent the attacks on it. So it uses this defensive chemical and the chemical name is cantharidin. So there will be reflex bleeding, what you call as autohemorrhization. And dried beetles contain up to 1% of cantharidin by weight. 1% dried beetles. So beetle is common name for all these type of insects. Okay. And this uh, they cause toxic, uh, they are toxic blistering, blistering agent. You can see uh, in this image how the blisters are produced after a bite of cantharis or Spanish fly. 30 milligram is a fatal dose for humans. If the 30 milligram of cantharidin is injected in the body of human being, it can be a fatal, it can take the life of, any, uh, of a human being. So uh, that is why uh, even it is used in as a medicine recommended by uh, Hippocrates and Galen to stimulate certain internal organs. Okay, cantharidin uh, is uh, uh, present in cantharis, that is Spanish fly. It is of animal origin and obtained from a soft parts of cantharides or Spanish fly, which consist of dried insects. Okay. Cantharidin is the anhydride of cantharidic acid. The insect contains both cantharidin and cantharidic acid. And it is used as a rubefacient or counter irritant, especially in veterinary medicine. And it should not be employed internally because, uh, because it is irritant. Uh, the real Spanish fly will just try to understand what does it mean. So order of this animal is uh, Coleoptera and the family is Meloidae. Okay, there are 2,000 species of blister beetles, uh, 68 species in the genus Lyta. Many are native to the countries surrounding the Mediterranean Sea. An African Spanish fly, uh, you can see here uh, through this image. It's usually found in Zimbabwe in Africa. Uh, genus is Myalabris, and uh, locally it is known as uh, uka 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 means wake up uta uta okay. most potent concoction is known as uh, spirals jump okay because spirals are considered to be very romantic animals so i tell you i'll tell you why this is called as because we are going to further a uh, slide and bister beetles are also uh, seen in this image which are uh, poisonous uh, you can see how it works Insects uh, as aphrodisiacs uh, are in use. Aphrodisiac uh, means, you know, it's a medicinal effect, usually stimulant uh, for the purpose of, you know, uh, sexual activity. So that is called as aphrodisiacs. Mm -hmm. uh, used as, uh, these are used as general aphrodi aphrodisiacs or low potions, what they call as. And they are stimulants, uh, you know, Viagra, uh, Viagra medicine, you must have heard about it. 
and potency enhancement uh, is the uh, actually uh, benefit to keep on and on in case of uh, you know males a history as old as hippocrates uh, and galen uh, you know speaks about this as aphrodite yes uh, it sells today also you can see a speck you can see a pack here in this image spanish fly used as a aphrodisiac so we are talking about its medicinal effects and aphrodisiac is also called is, is also part and parcel of medicinal effect and other bee and wasp venoms are uh, which cause desensitization of humans hypersensitive to uh, hymenoptera venoms and used in controlled serial doses okay uh, three to six months begins with the injection of uh, one by 200th of the venom of one bee or wasp it ends with an injection of equivalent venom of two bees or wasps so honey bee wasp means you know that el the elongated type of wasp which we found in home and these are all having venoms in them they may not be fatal they may not take life but they cause lot of irritation when they bite and pain also bee venom that means madhmashi the honey bee okay here you can see uh, insects are used as a medicine historically there are lots of examples and with this we have ended this part of uh, study which is uh, which is uh, uh, part uh, part of animal poisons so all together we we have studied uh, in animal poisons different types of snake uh, poisons and uh, different types of uh, scorpion poisons and different types of uh, fly poisons and with this uh, i uh, end this chapter itself on animal poisons today thank you uh, thanks a lot